plus in that chunk. Yeah, I'm going to be the presentation here. Yeah, it's alright, I just thought I'd check with you now, brother. Uh, yeah, I wouldn't mind. Leave it to the last minute. Yeah. <coughs> well, worst, yeah. worst case scenario, I'm coming first thing on uh, Sunday morning last year. Definitely fail. Yeah, sweet ass. Thanks, mate. Thanks, mate. Yeah, thanks, mate. Thanks, mate. Thanks,
Alrighty guys, uh, this, um, well this is Gusta Georgia here joined by Michael Scary for this plate final. How you going Mick? Good yourself? Yeah, good. Good. Um, a bit flat after our team's loss but we'll bounce back it's all good. at 4.30 I'm sure. <clears throat> yeah, 4.30 we take on WA. Mm. Yeah, so the... Mark's gotten off to a 3-0 uh, deficit here. Quite quickly. Yeah, I did hear um, Luke's done a, a couple of outs, and, yeah. and in the other frame, Mark potted the white on and out, I believe, and then Angles 
finished it off. So yeah, it's all good. Yeah, it's still, I mean, it's still sort of early stages. I mean, Mark would like this frame. He wouldn't want to go four one down. Yeah, race, race to nine. Still, still a lot in it. Yep. Um, uh, yeah, obviously these play two players have gone through some very good players along the way. That's right. A few supporters online. Jody, come on, Robbo, and uh, my brother, which is uh, Felidol. Mm -hmm. Online. So uh, Luke actually beat uh, Mark in the uh, in the main draw. In the singles, yeah. So I'm sure Mark will be looking to uh, avenge that loss. See it, redemption. Yep. Bit of work to do here though on the reds for Mark. Uh, just those two reds uh, next to each other. To find somewhere to put those. I reckon that red nearly goes off the yellow into the bottom left. Uh, three ball plant. Yep. That's it. That's a nice shot there by Mark. Oh yes. So he's on that red again off the yellow. Yeah, it opens everything right up. Would you play the uh, red off the yellow? Uh, uh, I guess he's going to go into him now. Yeah, he's got a nice little angle edge to yep. stun across. Because I think the yellow is a little bit too far out. Okay. He's, um, he decided then to actually go into the centre, but he didn't get past obviously yeah. the red and yellow. So he'll just he'll just take up here. Oh, that yeah. should come out a little bit. Yep. Yeah. I think Luke might have an edge of this yellow, so he's just going to flick off it and put the white around the top. Yeah, he wants to be careful. Yeah, he wants to be careful where he puts the white here because he might might actually. Um, Still leave Mark a pot on, maybe that red off the yellow, like what you said, or uh, you pretty much want to uh, hide hide the white behind the black. Um, pretty much the top right corner is, is ideal, I think. Would, would be nice. We'll see. He might go top left. Oh, okay. I don't think that's good Ooh, enough. That that red goes. I've been saying it now. That red goes off the yellow. Well, it looks like it from here anyway. Yeah, Mark's just going to get down and blast straight into it. He's um, he doesn't want to muck around too much. And get bogged down into like a five hour battle. Yeah. There we go. Medium pace, stun into it. Uh, just caught it a tad thick. I mean, even with these rules, how you can play a turnover shot, that's actually still pretty good. Yeah. Um. But the thing is, uh, Luke can't really play a turnover shot here because Mark has a red that's uh, waiting down there. Exactly. Oh. I don't know if Mark can see that red. I think it may oh. have just hugged. Hugged on, yeah, I think it's hugged. I don't think it's nestled up on the yellow. So. Yeah, I don't think you can see it. Can come off the side rail here. Once they hit it, it sort of soft to medium to get out. He would have liked it. He would have liked it in, obviously, and gone game. But it's a tad thick. Oh, if he missed it, did he hit it? No, he hit it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So you know, angles here still, still under the pump uh, a bit here. Do you like flicking off that yellow uh, at the bulk end and just leaving the white at the top left, top left corner? I just want to be careful here, actually, because Mark, obviously, one one slight slip up here, Mark, has got the frame, so Luke either has to, go, yeah, leaving the white at the top left is an option. Oh. Yeah, no, I didn't, didn't, I, like, didn't like that. I was going to say, I don't mind if Luke can, I didn't think the angle was there, I was going to suggest if Luke can pot his red, uh, pot the yellow, and take that red out of that corner pocket, um, then he's half a sniff, but he's actually played that really well. Got a tad fortunate to um, leave the yellow in the way, and if it is in the way, and also kill the black a little bit. Yep. So, anyway, he's tried to keep himself in the game and he's done that. 
and these TV tables especially are playing quite tight. I mean, you've got to be you've got to be accurate on them. <laughs> Getting nibs, let's go, Mark. <laughs> that's uh, that's my uh, pool channel that my brother, uh, myself, and my other brother has made. Uh, we do a bit of fishing, mm. and um, yeah, we have a YouTube YouTube channel called Get Nibs. If uh, you like fishing, chuck us a uh, comment and a hello on it. Yeah, it's good fun out there. Good fun on the water. That's where it'd be yeah, right now. Do. If it wasn't here. On it's the water. Be beautiful day today too, actually outside. Not too hot, not too cold. Blue sky. That's it. But where else would you rather be than here at the moment, Nick? It's, it's all happening. Probably with my kids. <laughs> <laughs> and the wife. Well, wife goes all right. Yeah. Uh, actually, uh, Mark's got a shot on this red. Yeah, yeah I think he's left him on that. Do you, do you play it soft and hopefully it doesn't sort of no. deviate? No. Do you play it hard. It's going to get away from you. Maybe he comes around yeah, the angle. But if, 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 as long as he gets anywhere on like the you know middle middle of the table, uh, that red's still cuttable. Yep. So he's gone hard. Well, I, I wouldn't have gone that hard. I was going. Oh, that's stiff. Well, I was going to say. I think you're going to. Well, I think you're going to see him go around the angles here. Well, he's going to. The, the issue is playing it soft. The white's going to stay on the, the right hand side of the table, and then Mark's well, going to probably have to cut it in. And no, but don't play to it too soft. You can still go like that. He, he hit that hard. What about like medium? Well, medium's going to leave you in a sort of similar position. No man's land. Mark wanted to be on the left hand side of the table here, not the right hand side of the table. So he had to take a bit of a risk. Mm. Um, still a bit stiff to go off the yellow. And uh, Mark's got his hand on his head now. He's up. He's up and about for this though. Um, we had a chat to him earlier, and you know, obviously he won this tournament last year, so he'd like to go yeah, back to back. He wanted to go back to Wouldn't back. He, he uh, couldn't stress about it enough. He's in the in the room thinking about it. So, you know, it's a, it's effectively it's effectively you know it, 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 yeah it's, it, well it is it's as hard as the uh, the main the main tournament. I mean, it's the same players. Um, yeah. Feels like I lost in this tournament uh, three weeks ago. Um, I can't remember who I played. <laughs> I don't think they remember you either. <laughs> so obviously, obvious problem, obvious problem for angles here is um, the black on the uh, the black on the rail. So it is in a position where it d doubles. But he'd like to get right behind his black and pot it down the rail. Mm. Um, but like I said, they are playing quite tight, Mick. Yeah, Alex. Um, Alex Steer says, "Feel bad for people thinking Mark's going to win." Uh, let's go, Luke. Bring well, the plate home. I think. Uh, look, I think Luke well, actually starts favourite for this match. I think the way he's been playing. Well, like we said, me beat him in the singles. So yeah, I think. Yeah. I, I think. Um, I think. I think Mark's the underdog. Mark's the underdog in this one. So. Um, and you know what? If Luke won this. Congratulations to him, like he's this nice guy. His he's smile, uh, his, his smile, smile just everyone. lights up the room. He should be the new um, poster boy for like a, a toothpaste commercial. <laughs> <laughs> I'd buy toothpaste off him. Oh, I've known him since. I'd buy toothpaste with his yeah. face on it, actually. Yeah. And I'd be happy every time I brush my teeth. Oh, it's going to go harder than if you want to extract it. Doesn't want to go in it. behind the black. Yeah, doesn't want to be behind hampered. The black and he's hampered. So he's going to settle for the double here, I reckon. If he can pinch. No, he can't. Oh, he can't. Well, if he can pinch a bit of the pocket, just punch it. Do you think he was uh, in two minds there? Just whether to play it soft or whether to play with the hard and go into the black or oh. the black? Because he could have passed the black like another foot and I don't still, been, still been okay. Yeah, I don't know if he committed to a shot. Actually, he, Jeez, he Chris. Did. Yeah, fishing channel's good. He can still I jack hope. up here. Marty Andrews. Nice to see you, buddy. Mm, Bit unlucky Marty. there on the uh, on our snooker final. It's all good. Marty, Mick told me that he's lost because he wasn't there. I never said such a thing. <laughs> so yeah, he tried to punch it. I don't, that doesn't double. Me. I think he's a bit in between here. Sort of yeah. maybe doesn't double. Does it cross double slowly? Oh, I think the white's going. I think I think the cross face double can't even do, do that. Play a, I mean, if you play a snooker and Mark gets out of it, then you're in trouble. So what do you do, guys? Well, how, depending how cuttable, how cuttable that red is, you don't even go for. The, you just make sure you bump the eight in sort of the middle of the table. Mm. I mean. And you know, yes, you are leaving Mark full ball with the red, but that red does look, if the white's on the rail, it does look like a very fine cut. So. Is he going to 
to sneak it in. No? Yes, yeah, so that's I, what... I like the shot. I think you just play it a tad harder and get the black just a See, little bit more sort of out there a little bit. Yeah, because even if Mark hits his red, Luke's going Luke's to get a tough shot. Yeah. Williams missed it. And there's a concession. So don't you worry though. Mark Mark's Mark's a fighter. He's, this is um I mean Luke will be happy with his four one lead. He'll yeah. know he'll know that he, he can't you know he yeah you know, he, he can't make too many errors against the, the, the quality of Mark. So <laughs> <laughs> Rusty, <laughs> Toby, <laughs> Rusty's a toothpaste man, yeah. Yeah, he's got the teeth for it, he's got the chompers, Rusty. Is Rusty still here? You can see, uh, I don't think so now. I think Rusty and uh, Sage, I think they left. I think they oh, actually, home. they're still in the doubles tonight, so no, they'll be, they'll be leaving they, after that. I think they pulled out of it. I think they've, um, oh, did they? I think they've gone home, yeah. <laughs> so, pretty sure they forfeited the doubles, from what I heard. <laughs> They, um, oh, they've got to give others a chance. And they've done that this year. Players, everyone in the chat. If you scroll up, you'll see uh, you'll see get nibs. Click click on that. Get in there. Check out. <laughs> I'm gonna give it a plug. Yeah, that's it. Check it out. Tell us what you think of the fishing channel. Maybe we'll have Rusty on board one day. Have a celebrity. Well, that's it. I mean, yeah, absolutely. On the other table, we have Colby Poole and Lindell. Lindell's leading 2-0. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Didn't even know. Well, go Lindell. That's on another video. Uh, yeah. Um, that's on a separate stream. Lindell Vine versus Colby Poole. It's the uh, women's final race mm. to seven. That's the plate final, I'm guessing, obviously. Uh, yeah. yeah, and the Masters Plate Finals, Wayne Stubbs and Calvin Lee. Okay, yeah, that'll be, that'll be a good one. Uh, Stubbsy is 2-1 down. I, uh, I got Cal in a beauty at the Gippy Cup. Ah, <laughs> yes, that was actually really good. That was really funny. Uh, <laughs> Explain to people what happened there. Uh, Calvin was potting out, and um, it's actually on... It was actually on my YouTube channel, but I, I did put it out there. He's potting out, and then he pots the black, and I quickly sneak in behind him and put a red back on the table and then told him that he forgot to pot all his balls. And yeah. he believed me. And for the whole match, he thought he'd, uh, he'd cost his team the match. And then we told him at the end, of, even, even, the, uh, even his team was in on it too. It was yeah. such a funny sight. <laughs> <laughs> Slap up this baldy, Keenan. Firing comments. We can't have all. We can't all have beautiful hair like you, Keenan. Right angles. Slap up this ball. Cheers, Marty. Oh, went for the plant there, but clipped the yellow on the way through. So, um, you know, Luke, Luke's going to have to take, you know, he's going to take his chances. Um, Mark's very hard to beat on the best of days, let alone a race to nine. 
Pues a... So Mark's just going to bottom, yellow bottom left and uh, crash into the red and yellow that are stuck together. Oh, it's worked out. Not That's a treat. Not Could he go into him again off this uh, off yellow? Top yellow. Uh, this bottom yellow to the left corner? Screwing. Maybe. Or he might be able to take the top yellow, stun off the cushion back out, then play the double and then open up. Yeah. The yellows as well. So oh, oh, yeah, this one now. Yeah, I don't know if he's going to screw back or just come off the rail. Yeah, screwed back. How's he gone? Probably not good. Oh. Yep. <laughs> not good. <laughs> so now he's going to blast. I oh, know, he can't even blast that. I think he just takes a two way. He might be able to take the red out of the center bag. <laughs> and. What's that? <laughs> Did Didn't want to put any more balls there. Just missed them. <laughs> so, fair support in the room here. Yep. Crowd's building. Yep. Here at the not, uh, around, not around Mark, though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's, uh, he's got one supporter oh, there. He's got us, but we're in the commentary box. There's, so there's Scott, Scott Parker. Scott I don't know Parker. the other guy's name, but uh, it's uh, 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 Roy oh. Noblet's son. Oh, that, oh yes, that's oh yes. He's oh. actually a decent good good player. He is. Good up and he's actually a good young player. Roy's been teaching him for a good year now. Well, his dad's very good. Yes. Made a few state sides himself, so sure has. <laughs> nah, he's a good kid. And he's here watching, here learning. Well, that's it. I mean, he'll be getting he'll be getting so much out of this. Ooh, it's going to stay up because of the side. Yeah. I don't know if that'll do. Um, it might. Some so give us some score predictions for Vic versus WA, people. Vic versus WA at 4.30. Give us some score predictions. Vic are... Uh, we uh, struggled a bit that last one. Yeah, I mean... There's a lot of chances given away. You've really got to take your chances against SA. SA. haven't lost for... They've actually haven't lost for almost two years now, so... That's not going to cover. That's not going to cover. Tell up, Mark. Do you think... Is he going to plough into them, or is he going to... You know what? Actually, here's a shot, Gus. He plays the top yellow, he comes down about midway, then plays the bottom left yellow, and then stuns into the bottom right yellow, uh, leaving I'll himself on the well, middle yellow. I like it, Mick. You weren't even listening. That's <laughs> he's not going to do anything. Oh, he's, gonna, he's playing tactics. Okay, that's, that's, a, that's a clever shot. Yeah, nothing wrong with that. It's not exciting, but there's nothing wrong with it. Sorry, training. He, um, can we get a replay of that, Dan? That last shot by Luke. Hey, uh, he, he come off the back. He come off yeah, the side rail. He must. Have, pace. If he's landed there with the white, that's um, yeah. it's a dream result. down the table. Oh wow. Well. Couldn't have played that any better. Yeah. Look at that. That's, that's just that's that. a dream result. A 
absolute dream result. This is tough though. You watch you don't come up behind that yellow and snook yourself. No, he's played it well. He's going to miss the was, yellow too. I was going to say, um, but actually, the, yeah, there was nothing wrong with the the actual pot. Looking at the table from just my yeah. eyes, it was actually fairly straightforward. Someone of Luke's class. Race to nine. Oh. Do you see Mark coming back? Uh, yeah, yeah. He, he's like I said, he, he was up for this, and <laughs> he, he knows the, the player of Luke's class. He's um, like even racking the balls. You can see he's he's up for it. And, you look, and, <laughs> and the look on his face, that determination of just he's like a yeah, you know, he's steely eyed. He's like a tiger. <laughs> tiger from Thailand. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. See, yeah. look at that. Cow. <laughs> Not oh. a ball. <laughs> oh, they have landed. I mean, they've these are. Dodgy yeah. These are far from. Red? Um, oh, I thought reds at yeah, first glance. Can't outclass the WA boys. Fair enough. Mm. We have beaten them twice, though, Keenan. So, hoping that, uh, I mean, they're, they're a quality side. And, uh, yeah, going to have to play well. Um, aren't we, Mick? It's going to be a good match. Uh, quality all the way down their list, so. Yeah. Okay. Just a safety by Mark. I think you're gonna see a few safeties here. Yeah. Um, oh, actually, has he, is open. there a gap? Is there a gap for that red? Yeah, Lucy's is hanging now. Yeah. Even if he gets it though, there's still a little bit of work to be done. Um, he, oh, dodgy red at the top. There is, but he's got reds around that other dead red that he can try and extract. Oh, he's done it. He, oh, he's extracted it well too. Yeah. Play interviews would be great. Ah, uh, yeah. We'll try and get one with Mark after this match, actually. <laughs> you can, actually. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, that would be good, actually, play interviews. Who would you like to see? Give us, like, your mm. your top top three that you'd like to see, and maybe, like, two questions or three questions that you could quickly fire at them. Yeah. And uh, maybe I'll try and get that done for you. <laughs> Luke here, just, mm. I, I think that red might not go, so I think you might just give the little the red a little tickle or the yellow. Yep, that's perfect. You went in the yellow so he can actually be on to the red Although, the top end of the table. has he got angle though on this red? He doesn't angles. want to be straight. Angles has got angles. He creates angles, doesn't he? Angles has got angles. Do you think when Luke wakes up in the morning, he's just smiling? Oh, it's it's just I, I've never seen him not smile. I mean, it's and look, it's, it's a lovely smile. I think the only time you think he's angry if he did like a cartwheel or like a handstand and he was upside he's down. Gone. Yeah. <laughs> he's such a nice guy. Look at that view. Uh, yeah, I think both threads both threads sneak past. I think maybe the one on the left there is half a pocket. You play a double here and come around off two or three. Just got to watch the yellow near his left hand. And the centre pocket too. Centre pocket. Because if you nick that yellow, the white was going towards the centre pocket. Mm. All right, there's a chance for Mark here. Actually, it's not really a chance. <laughs> Actually, I think Mark would need to sort of 
put a few of the yellows down this end of the table if you wanted to um, sort of fight his way back in. Yeah, absolutely. Well, well, we might be able to get a like a, a Facebook Live or something because I'm pretty sure they're already in the car. <laughs> and I think Justin's driving Rusty. Good shot there by Angles. So Mark's going to try and free up these yellows here, put Angles under a bit of pressure, and send the white at the top of the table. Or oh, no, just sneak it in there. That's even better. Yeah, that's it. Actually, a fair crowd watching the um, watching the women's one, actually. Belly put fifty dollars on it. It's five one up, Keenan. You can't have bets now. It's a bit mm -hmm. dodgy, but uh, that's that's pretty good. I'm not going to send another red, another yellow down here. Come on, Come on. <laughs> going to tuck in, send a yeah. yellow down. That's good. You don't want it over the pocket. In like, That's okay. Yeah. Do these that two reds? Do they do they plan on the the, the, the right he, hand? Maybe that's what he's sort of looking oh, at. Oh, well, he probably can't get through. Long way to go in this frame. Yeah. Um, you know where the balls lie. But you think Mark would really need to get this one? At least at least get to three or four before um, Luke gets to seven. I think. It, yeah, for sure. If Mark's seven four, I think he's a chance. As long as he keeps Luke two away from uh, two away from the win, mm. then that's still that's still nice. Jeez, he's gonna yeah. he goes right so, off the red. So he's going for that. Both. He's trying to try and pocket both. Yeah, that was um, a bit crazy, but it worked out alright. It actually worked out. He didn't touch those two yellows, no. which he could have easily done. Um, Tell you what, I'll tell you what, Cannon. I'll have a hundred push-ups. Says that Mark wins this match. How's that? Hundred push-ups. Good pot. Words to hear though. How's he going to tackle those two yellows uh, on the right-hand side of the rail? Yeah. Is he going to open them up now a little bit? Oh, will this push it? No, it's made it. Oh. Yeah, it's made it worse. <clears throat> oh, he's he's gone full blooded. Here, look at this. He's going to nick off it and hide behind the yellow. He's going to hide behind the yellow. That's a great shot. So Gus is on Tinder, so we're not. He didn't appreciate that. Would have liked it maybe a tad harder just to open up both those yellows, but. He's definitely got Luke under the pump here. All right. Uh, so 
Mark just trying to force. Okay. He's running out of yep. time. He's just yeah, trying to force he, one little mistake. But Luke oh, 15 wants, just being called now. Luke wants the so white wants ball oh, at the higher end of the table because it stays down here. Gee, there must be only a few seconds left. Oh. oh he's, oh, a, he's moved Mark's extraction ball yeah. <laughs> and killed it. <laughs> wow. That's actually uh, it's actually worked out no good. I think Mark's going to unisee Mark flick off with these two yellows and put the white where the black, red, yellow situation is. I think that's the obvious shot. Would you play that, Mick? Uh, if you said it, I'll play it. That looks good. He, and the reason for that is he gets to open up his dead balls and lays a good snooker as well. Yep. Not even a snooker, just... And he's going to be promoting him as well, so there's a lot of bonuses in this shot. Well, he wants to, wants to get more in shot. there. Yep, oh, he has, yeah. Has he still killed them? Yeah, he still he still would have liked to have promoted them a better or even like and when it, a when set it's not plan. going your way, it's not going your way. Yeah. So what are you doing here, Gussie? Are you just basically just smacking in the double? Smacking in the double, um, going into the black, getting everything out? I'm probably just giving him the frame, to be honest, at this point. Um... No. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah, Robert. But Luke's Luke's a far better, far better player. Why are we listening to a cheat that has brought this game into disrespect? Dis are you obviously talking about who are you talking Why about? Land lover. Just <laughs> <laughs> can't be talking about me because if you're talking about that push shot, I have nothing to do with it. I sat in my corner, um, and Josh actually came up to me and said he wasn't sure, so they're gonna he's gonna find out. So it's actually got nothing to do with me. I think Josh is a great kid, and um, yeah, I had nothing to do with the call. If Josh said to me that he didn't fail, I would have said, yeah, no problem, go for it. But he said he wasn't sure, and he wanted to know. Um, he wanted to ask, so he did. And uh, as everyone saw here, I sat in my chair, I didn't say a word, um, and Josh came over next to me, and we just waited for a call. So. I didn't ask for it. That was Josh. Alrighty. Mark's still got that yellow uh, yellow on the rail there, so he has to... Um, who wins out of uh, Brendan? Who wins out of Stone and Barney? Man, Barney, uh, they're both actually playing, playing well. Um, it's nice to see Stone uh, at the business end. Um, I saw him putting his last couple of balls and uh, he was heavily heavy breathing and you, you just know how badly he wanted it and um, yeah it was awesome so uh, I, just, I can't pick a winner out of them too I think they're just I think it's going to go down the wire um, yeah I can't pick a winner there Yeah, at the end of the day, um, I suppose they can't determine, realistically, they can't determine if it's a foul or not, but, you know, it is what it is. Um, yeah, I don't really know what else to say. I mean, it's done and dusted now. I mean, they, these people keep beating a dead horse. I mean, get over it. It's happened. Josh is a great kid. Josh, Josh is, um, he's doing absolutely fine. Yeah, I, 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 don't, I don't see any... Wait, it's just getting boring now, guys. Like it's it's boring. It ABF, um, yeah, all right. So Luke is actually looking. Uh, Mark, I think played that. He yeah. played the double. Maybe just a tad soft, but I don't know if he could have played it much harder because the way the white was. He actually didn't land on it. Yeah, nah, properly. Yeah. Angles Good gonna, shot there by Angles. Yeah, he's going to put in the snooker here. Oh, Mick Delante just... Uh, Knocked up. Knocked up, yeah. They've subbed him in. Well, I don't know if they need him. No, nah, they <laughs> Maybe he can come in outside. 
<laughs> how are you? Uh, how are you getting onto this black gussy? Are you maybe no, stunned to the rail yeah. and playing the red off one two, and then um, coming out? Are you playing for a double? No, I'm. I'm I want the white here in the uh, middle of the table. Cause yeah, go on. Yeah, because I want to then have the white come off the. Um, I want to have the white coming off that left-hand side rail. Do you think you can screw into the black if you needed to? I, I think I think he'll be able to get right behind this black. I mean, you know, at this level, you just back yourself to land on it. Yeah, that that I think he needs it. He needs it more to go though. He needs more angle. But that's how I would have played the shot. Just with, I would have liked um, the white more of the over the right-hand side. A lot of players over here are screwing up to the table and trying to land on the double because mm. they are playing tight these pockets. You've got to be super super accurate. Yeah, Jake was saying uh, yesterday if the if the balls were actually mm. cleaner, they would actually slide in more as well. Like, yeah, yeah. So he screwed back. I was going to say, you think he's Oy. oh, but see now he's on it. Oh. <laughs> exactly. That was actually a good shot because. If he doesn't get the nudge, he's where he is. If he does, then there's a chance to land on the black. And uh, if he lands short, he can possibly play uh, a double. So I don't mind the shot. Now, a lot of players here would play this with like a bit of safety in mind, but this is one you just just knock it in. He's playing top, so he's putting a bit of safety in mind, which can be missed, but he okay. played that beautifully. Yeah. So. Looks good out there, Luke. Looks good out there. Oh, even the, the whole, even the whole South Australians have just gone. Come on, angles. Uh, <laughs> that, was, that was actually quite weird. Uh, <laughs> angles is, does have a lot of fans. He, he's he, look. He's uh, yeah. All right, six one. Um, oh, I think. Well, this frame here. Oh, I think Mark just has to. Oh, what a break! Has what to break. win it. Uh, Tusha, do you think the Supremes make a more even playing field compared to the English tables? Uh, compared to the English tables, are these are the English tables, aren't they? He means our like our oh, seven our footers. Our, yeah. Well, yes. Yeah, with these kind of tables, the the playing field is definitely a lot closer. The mistakes are more magnified. Um, cause, and, and everyone actually has a good break now. So, you know, I did practice my break on the seven footers a, a couple of years ago to try and get it at a really, really high level and consistent level. But now, uh, on these tables, it's just everyone has a great break. And um, it definitely has brought everyone closer and it's a lot harder to win any tournament now. So, yeah, it definitely, definitely has made a difference. But it's made a difference for the better, I think, because... It's it's quicker, it's more enjoyable to watch, and um, yeah, I think it's good. I think April's healthy. So I mean, reds reds here look pretty good. Just that left on the that red on the left hand side rail. Yeah. So we sort of pulled the cue back there. That was um, it's interesting. Um, You'd say if Luke wins this, would this be, I don't know, if Luke's won any sort of uh, a it'd big be up titles? There with, it'd be up there with one of the big the, the, the big tournaments. I mean, this is a big tournament. I mean, it's just a, it's a plate. It says a plate, but at the end of the day, he's missed the extraction. Nice. Yeah, he's landed perfect on the double. Still goes, still doubles, yeah. But this is still a big a big tournament. He's still had to knock off a lot of players, and, and it's just basically this is like an Australian title, to be honest with you. Um, they just need to change the name of it, to be honest with you. Oh, I'd be playing a I double now, me. I think he can risk the double here now. 
Because the double might come off two rails and go into that yellow that's above the red. I think it's worth the risk. I think take it now. Because if you don't take it now, you've still got to you've still got to get onto it. Yeah, I mean, you wouldn't want to leave it till too late. Oh, I, well, I think he's, uh, he's digging himself a hole so, now. Yeah, well, like I said, you've still got to get onto it. Um, so if you took that now and it went pear-shaped, Mark was still in all sorts. Son Maddox is watching Mark play. Hey, buddy, how are you? I miss you. I'll be home soon and we'll be able to catch up and do a little bit of soccer training. Oi. Nah. Oh, I think top, top right here. So here we go. He's going to go top, top right corner. Taking this in the corner pocket. Yeah, up there. Oh, is it? Oh, yeah. uh, big, big chance for Robbo here. Yeah, well, this is it now. Yep. If Mark doesn't take these chances, then it's um, it's curtains. Get rid of the plate, shorten the comp. Um, I think the plate should be just be the plate at the start of the comp it should go for like a day no more than a day and a half and be done be done with there's another one from uh, get nibs thanks Dan yeah look I honestly um, two weeks away almost two weeks away from work family all that it is it is hard and I think um, it would be nice if the Nationals went for literally six days and we just played. That's a good shot. shot there. And they just, you know, we just played over six days. We had the, we had maybe the, obviously the singles and the teams, and that was pretty much it. Um, and then we could all, you know, sort of go back to work and stuff after, you know, just over a week. But having two weeks is a, it is a long time. Um, don't get me wrong, everything's perfect. Everything's done right. Um, tournament's run well. But it's just, yeah. it is a long time to actually be away too, so. Feels like we've been here a couple of months. All right, so this is exactly what Mark needed, just a bit of a, just a few tap-ins. Yep. Yeah. He, he still had to make the out with a nice extraction. Yeah. Just in case he goes back and watches this, I don't get a message. There he is. <laughs> <laughs> It's a 6 2. 6 2. Race to nine. The thing about these, obviously, rules and tables is that you could actually lose three or four frame, frames very quickly. So it's, um, you know, even a 6 2 lead could all of a sudden, eight or ten minutes from now, be 6 5. You know, or even seven five, it, it can happen so quick. So, yeah, absolutely. Where the other tables, the other rules, and the other tables, you know, some matches, some frames could go for half an hour, forty minutes. Oh, I've just found a shot here, Mick. This red top left. Leave yourself to the red, to the right middle, and extract that yellow and red situation on yep. the side rail. Actually, actually, can get to it. I don't, think, yeah. I don't think you can get to it. Oh, that one there, yeah. Yeah, I, I point at the screen even though you can't see. Oh, and I'll tell you what, if Mark gets a couple more frames, um, he sort of jumped off the shot there a little bit, Luke. I know he moves, but. I think Luke's uh, improved a hell of a lot too over the last year or two. 
definitely come a long way. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, and he's definitely yeah, right yeah, up yeah. there with, with you know, some of the best players in Australia now. So Absolutely. And WA, they just they are just getting stronger and stronger every year. A lot of good players. I think it's Clint's birthday today too, so happy birthday, Clint. Yeah, happy birthday, Clint. Yeah, that's right, Morgan. You can't, you can't, you can't make a lot of mistakes, mm. especially at this level too, and playing these players. And you're in a final, so the guy that you're playing isn't, you know, a newbie. He's he's done he's done well to get there, and he's he's knocked off some good players to get there as well. So, uh, yeah, basically, you have to almost not make a lot of mistakes to actually win one of these things. Otherwise, um, yeah, the other guy can actually run away with it pretty quick. So Mark's just noticing a bit of a shift here, a bit of a change in the in the match, and I think he's um, not slowing things down, but just just making sure because he knows if he can get this frame and possibly the next, uh, it, it's sort of game on again. Absolutely. There's four frames. I mean, uh, three frames actually. Luke, Luke needs, but I feel like as long as you can always keep your opponent two frames off the finish, you know, you're always always a chance. Yeah. If they get to, if they get on their hill, then you know you can't. Uh... Yes! Yeah, you, know, you can't. You know you can't make any errors, really. <sighs> Luke's got to be looking for an extraction here, or maybe. That yellow just to the right of the white there might go off the red over the pocket and open that, open it up, but he's still, he's still got a bit to deal with here. The way the balls have been turning out, though, um, to been commentating, you know, there's there's always been. Always been issues, hasn't yeah, it? Yeah, there's always something to deal with. Yeah. They, haven't, they haven't been tapping them. No. Yeah, and tappings are hard these days. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I had I had tappings. <laughs> oh, I, had, I wasn't. I wasn't I even going up. there, Mick. No, nah, no. Nah, it is what it is. I uh, fought back well to get back with Andy, mm. and um, I had the easiest out of all time, and just I just took it. I, I don't know. I think I just took it maybe too easy on that ball that I didn't come out far enough for. I could have landed literally anywhere I wanted in in one half of the table and I think I decided just to be sort of too perfect and um, yeah and it is what it is I mean, you live and you learn you know um, and it's all about the fight like I, I fought back well and I'm never not gonna try and fight back and I did what I did and it's a shame it sucks and it hurts it really does yes. um, but you know good luck good luck to Andy and I think the final is gonna be a ripper with Andy and, and the stone in it so well there's actually gonna be a first time winner yeah, that's right. Um, and it's always good to see. You know, you're, you've already, uh, you've Ooh, already. Got... I tell you what. Oh, oh wow. I was going to say that could almost be a stalemate. <laughs> um. No, if basically stalemate. So if Luke can't hit his red, which is... Luke's on red. Yeah. So if you can move the white with your hand around those yellows, then it's not a stalemate. But if those yellows were sort of uh, a bit closer together and then you couldn't literally move the white and get it out of there then it and to hit another red then it's a stalemate actually Luke's on yellows here not reds uh, what's so now if those two yellows mm. oh, so Mark look at Mark's in trouble there's actually no way he can really get out of here he's just pointing to the camera uh, look at this so yeah. <laughs> so is this a stalemate? Uh, yeah. No, I mean, it's not a stalemate because you can move the white through the gap with your hand. As long as yeah. Is it, the white's going to go off, this, the white's going to go off the table here. Or it's going to jump up in the air and hit him in the head. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, I actually, 
I, is that, I don't know if that is that. Well, he's jump, uh, Well, he'd actually jump any balls. You, so that's. Let's um, have a look at the replay here. Yeah, he didn't actually jump. Did, he actually went to jump. He jumped over that ball, yeah. but he come off the jaw. I suppose as the ref, if as a ref, if they don't think it's legitimately. <laughs> Luke's going right. again here. <laughs> oh. Uh, is that is there a gap wait, there? If there's no. I oh know there's a gap there. So the gap's big enough for the white to fit through. No, I, I, can he get through there? Not by queuing it. <laughs> uh. mm. Luke wants to be careful here because if, if that yellow uh, smothers the red a little bit more down mm. the bottom, if Mark pots all his reds, then it's automatically a, uh, a stalemate. But you can get through. Oh, okay, yeah. Oh, look where her red's gone. So, I'm, I'm pretty sure... So, yeah, I'm pretty sure you... you the, the white left the table. I just, I just don't know if that's a foul or not, but... I mean, you don't mean to do it, I guess. Oh, look at this. What a shot. Oh, oh that works. Now we can go into them off that middle, uh, middle yellow. Yeah, so you obviously you gotta have a go here. Well, it's pretty easy to get a smile out of Luke. You just yeah, um, you can't have a mark. I don't know. You just, I think he wakes up smiling. <laughs> oh, he didn't quite. Uh, He's playing a little bit, a bit aggressive. I mean, that's the way he plays. But when you play this way, if things go a little bit bad, then your opponent's got a lot of chances. So I think Monk's stayed in the frame here pretty good. It's pretty cool, uh, pretty cool getting out of the snooker thingy. Yeah, oh yeah, that was, that was. He'll, uh, um, I'm sure he'll uh, tell us all about it too. And Yeah, I'll have to record that and try it on the channel. <laughs> That's right, that was cool. He's just doubled and actually, load. he's got a chance here. Th load this up with left hand side, yep. and knock the uh, knock so, that red out of the way. Correct. And you don't want you want to hit this soft too, so yeah. the side takes and goes into the red. Otherwise, you'll slip past the red, and you're going to snooker yourself. So exactly like that. Uh, oh, 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 he's riding it. I thought he probably played that a little bit too precise. He could have gone a bit more, a bit harder, a bit. Yeah. yeah. I think he's played it pretty good. Tickled every ball there, didn't it? Mick? It tickled every ball. That's yeah, right. I wonder if he can get out for the black here. Oh, that's a good shot. Wow, I can't so, believe he spotted out from here. This is absolutely huge. Uh, actually, yeah, this is going to be 7 2. For a double and then the extraction. Got a couple of little nice kisses off the extraction. Oh, what's the key ball? 7-2. Oh. Uh, good out. So, if you're on Mark in this position, yep. what would you do here? Probably go home. Um, <laughs> <laughs> nah. Um, okay, well, like I, like this is the point now where as long as you always keep your opponent two frames away from the win, keep saying you're, that. you're always, yeah, well, you're always in. Okay, maybe change, change something up, maybe. But, I mean, he hasn't really... Uh, I mean, he hasn't he hasn't done a whole lot wrong. Um, sort of a couple of errors there. They usually forget about what's he done wrong or right. What would you do right now? What would you do right now? Um, I'd maybe take I don't know maybe take a little break. Maybe go to the get toilet. A drink, yeah. Wash your hair. Um, your hands. Just do something to try and uh, stop the uh, the momentum here that Luke's got. Yeah, agreed, Kevin. I think that uh, I think that was a great out from Angles there. Oh, well, he's got 100%. an open table here. Let's have a look at the table here. I think if Luke was your dad and he told you off, he'd just 
laugh at me. He'd do it with a smile, yeah. though. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know. Um, if you're ever having a bad day. I don't know, is Luke single? I don't know if Luke's... Oh, I'm not sure, I'm not going to go there. Well, you know, well, well, Gus, still... I don't know if he's interested in you, but... Uh, oh, that's actually, that's actually nice. For Mark was, there. Um, yeah. I just think he's got a great personality. Uh, <laughs> You know, he's a good-looking guy. There's just there's everything going for him. So, and a very good pool player. That's what the women like. Which, which gets you a long way. So you just need to find yourself a good woman. Um. Yeah. Yeah. I well. Uh, yeah. You know. I mean, I'm quite happy doing what I'm doing at the moment. You know. Um, I don't know how we're looking for the completely long track. So anyway, Mark's on the out here. Um, I missed it. So he's just potted a book. You'd think Mark would make these, wouldn't you? Uh, someone at his level, I, I would assume so. Well, you, you, you'd make these. Not me, not, not yesterday, no chance. <laughs> <laughs> No, I had a Although yeah. you did do a master break this morning, though, Mick, in the teams, which was very nice. Um, master break? That's, that's a break in pot out, Mick. Yeah. That was, that's not bad from... So I think he just needs to screw back here a little bit. Yep. Sort of halfway in between the yellow. Where he's pointing now, yeah. He doesn't have much room to play with here, so his range is minimal. So pretty much you want to be straight, don't you? And that looks good. Yeah. He's done a good. Yeah. That's the shot. He'll keep, he'll keep fighting, Mark. And now, if he's got some angle, he would like to probably get to the bottom rail and like like fat on the bottom rail so he can actually naturally knock in the yellow and come down for the black. Uh, he wants to be on the rail. He wants to be on the rail. He's oh, is he straight? A little bit, he's a little bit straight. I think he's got a little bit of angle. That's a great shot. Yeah. So he's known for his uh, his good uh, cue ball control, Mark. <laughs> he's pulled one back. Stubbs versus Calvin Lee. Uh, Calvin Lee is 4-2 up on Wayne. And Lindell versus Colby. Colby is 3-2 up on Lindell. Now, Lindell's just level leveled it up at three apiece. Ooh. What a break here. Uh, again, though, I mean... Uh, well, he's... Uh, I'll be going reds here, and straight away... Yeah, reds, center, take the centre one, screw down into the... Yep. You are absolutely spot on there, Michael, scary. So Mark's going to probably take the... I'd really love a pen right about now, but... <laughs> here we go, he's going to screw off the bottom rail into the yellow and red. Oh, oh no. Oh. He's going to go something different. He's seen a different route. Okay, so that yellow, it didn't actually look like it on here, but that yellow does actually go... Oh, it's still, but can he get can he get the white out though, Mick? That's the problem. The white when he gets uh, he on that tried, yellow. He tried to actually land on the yellow in the centre there, yeah. um, and then open it up that way. But um, don't know. I think maybe could have been reds. I mean, look, reds had an argument, yellows had an argument. So Mark's going to be leaving this extraction very close to his last ball. He'd probably like to get down to the centre one now, so he's not leaving it to the end. Yep. So you'll see him come down the table. He needs to come, needs to come down. That's okay. Yep. So now he might come off the back rail here and not go into the red. He just needs some movement. No, he's done it that way, which is fine. Mm. He so has to reroute here. Yeah. yeah. Tell you what he can do, this might sound crazy. 
but he can play this with a lot of top and it, it might come off sort of one two but sort of stay in that area and like, like doing like, like an a arc. still shot yeah like a like that oh, oh. Oh, nah. anything anything but uh, kissing that red four wall yeah like if it, if it kissed it either either yeah yeah that's it just throwing the handbag oh, at hang it. on hang on oh that's Something. actually yeah Something. it's actually going in a bit of an annoying spot for Luke but in these situations now with these rule sets when you've got one ball on the table and your opponent has five six seven balls you know you um, the one with the five five balls on the table is massive favourite because it's not like you can you know kill your you know um, yeah I actually don't know what I was saying there. Also, got to thank Dan Lynch, obviously sitting oh. in his chair for 10, 11, 12 days, oh, making sure all this is uh, all this is happening uh, properly and everything's online for everyone to watch at home and in the future. So thanks again, Dan, Cubeball TV. Yeah, it's unbelievable being here. what he does. And all the uh, all the technology and the cameras that move by themselves. And soon I think we're going to have pocket cams. Well, that arena he actually built. Yeah, that arena yeah, we're that looking was pretty, at. I was looking at it the other day, actually. Oh. Pretty cool. How do you fit it in the car? Look at this shot. Oy. Oh, it's going to be a little something. Oh, that's 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 a bonus. So in one hour from now, WA take on Vic. Oh, it's in one hour. In one hour. Wow. WA take WA take on Vic, and the winner. The winner will book themselves a spot against SA in the Australian team's final tomorrow. Uh, also, I got the news yesterday. I'm pretty sure that the Worlds yep. aren't here. They're uh, yet oh. to be decided. No one wanted to come to Australia. Oh, here we go. What a and shot. And that's a great what shot. A shot. <laughs> you know, I was actually a little bit stiff too because he's actually left Luke on the one in the centre and he's moved yeah. the yellow up. Yeah, like one, one good potty oh. from Luke and yeah, you would think he'd take himself to an 8-3 lead. Yeah, so yeah, Worlds isn't here. It's well, actually... It's... Um, yet to be decided because apparently teams didn't want to travel to Australia. It's amazing they can't come over just once, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, I mean, we, we've done it for years and years and years. Um, it's been in England pretty much forever, and the one time that it's down here, you think they can just, you know, obviously make, make their way down, but obviously not. I think, I well, think we should automatically win. Dan's just saying we should automatically win. And I think so too. Block, block, Luke. Obviously, there's a lot of players that sort of popped their heads in this year in Nationals to try and make the Australian team mm -hmm. and obviously wanted to have a chance of making that obviously team and winning a world title next year and you know I was I was obviously trying this year to make the Australian team as well and having a chance to win the world title next mm. year for Australia um, and it all starts obviously at Nationals here and mm. your state practicing at home it's uh, a lot of time and effort goes into it you know, and to find out that information it's pretty sad yeah especially when you're you know you yourself Mick it looks like uh, you know you what you know well I think you will make the Australian team Mick I don't but, um, know well, it's all based on my it's opinion all, but, um, it's all done on numbers now, yeah so, we'll so yeah so that, that is that is a um, bit of a I'm not worried about that we just need to uh, win the team's title exactly that, that's a bonus so that's what, that's what you, that's what you come to nationals for. Um, yeah. It is to win for your state. Beating beating SA in the grand final. Well, that's that's exactly right. We've led them into false sense of security. Um, the last uh, two matches. Last two years. <laughs> yeah, the last two years. Yep. Now they've been SA have been very good, and WA have only been getting stronger. So I will tell you what, if it's not us, it's got to be WA. <laughs> yeah. I think uh, uh, I think WA can easily beat SA. Oh, 
Luke looks like he's running away with his match. 8-3, Luke Anglesey, one away on the hill. So Luke's just gone to take a uh, go to the toilet. <laughs> He'll be back in a sec. He's going to go wash his hands. How does the selection actually happen? Um, it used to be off a panel of judges of, of anywhere from anywhere from four and six. Um, but now, to take it out of their hands. Um, it's all done on maths now, and there's certain it's a certain criteria, certain algorithm, certain this and certain that. You get points for this, you get points for that, and uh, the computer just spits out uh, the Australian team, and that's how it works. You get a certain amount of points for the plate, you get a certain amount of points for um, the singles, you get a certain amount of points for where your team finishes as well. Um, so, for example, let's just say uh, SA win it, and let's say... New South Wales are last, then New South Wales actually, as a team, you get more points. And whoever finishes first actually gets less points. It's basically to help the people that, you know, obviously might... Let's say someone like a Chris Beagley in a way as well. Um, very, very good player. Um, let's say he, you know, wins the singles or something like that. Um, he'll get some more points because, you know, he doesn't have to play, you know, SA... He doesn't have to play like SA twice or Victoria. I mean, he does have to play them, but for someone like that's in Victoria, we have to play. Um, we play everyone obviously twice, but we don't have to play ourselves twice. You know, where someone like you know plays from NT does ACT and everyone else. Um, it is quite the way they've done it. I mean, I can't explain it too much because I don't exactly know it myself, but. It's uh, a few people have, have worked out a criteria for it, and um, they, they they trialed it last year. And as uh, as we go forward, um, I think it's going to be uh, pretty much pretty much set. So the computer will just literally just pick out the Australian team every year, and it won't be it won't be um, basically handled by five or six judges. That was a decent uh, toilet break. <laughs> so Lindell and Colby, um, ah, still still three all. Yeah, go Lindell. So um, Wayne Stubbs uh, and Calvin Lee are yep. uh, still four three. Okay, Kate, yeah, two Cal good Calvin matches Lee. there. All right, Mark has just called upon his uh, crowd. Uh, yeah, they're, they're yeah they're they're in now. So, Robbo needs six frames. Luke needs one. What do you think the odds are? Um, yeah, look, I ten mean, to one. He needs to play. Well, he's going to need some. He's going to need some luck going his way as well as play. Um, he, needs, he needs to play better. Obviously. I mean, because you'd think Luke. Luke's got a few breaks. To come, yeah. you know it's. Yeah, it's probably more like twenty to one, maybe fifteens. I think if he gets back, if he gets back, say to eight five, I think then it goes to say yep. maybe eight to one, ten yep. to one. WA men's to win teams event. K 
Kevin. Um, good chance. Definitely a good chance. Obviously, I'm playing the Vic side, so I'm hoping that we win. But if we don't, then um, I really think that they, they definitely do have a big chance to win WA. All right, Mark, going to maybe open up the uh, yellow and red here. Oh, look at this. And it hasn't worked out. I think he back doubles this yellow. He's just looking to see if it's touching or frozen. No, he's going to go the long route. White ball around the world, around the yellows. There it is. There's one. What a shot. Oh, that's a great shot. What a shot. What a shot. Uh, a <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, the old Neil's brother. Hey. Luke, 100 to 1. Tell you what, 100 to 1, I would have 10 bucks on that. Oh, 50 bucks on that, actually. <laughs> 10 to 1. 100, 100 to 1. Yeah. Oh, oh, you know what? Never mind. <laughs> Alrighty, and there's your. I think there's your. Alright, Lukey, your take it away. Right there. Well, at least Mark's got to have a good hit on the TV tables, which you're about to play on. Yeah, yeah. Against WA. That's it. I think he'll be. That's what he'll be happy about. I reckon. This is, is this is important for Luke as well. Okay. Um, you know, Luke's. I can't see anything anything wrong here. I think Luke. No. Luke's uh, good. This is. <sighs> yeah, that looks good. Yep. Yep. All right. So, take the left ball. Have a, have a look. It just plant. looks just nice, doesn't it? The play the plant. Say, so, say, so play the left ball. Come back a bit. Or he's going to play it now. Plant. That's fine. No. Yellow onto yellow. Or you just play the no. yellow and come around. No, no, yeah. The same thing. Oh, the, I think the plant was half missable. Nah. Well, maybe me yesterday. <laughs> Balls <laughs> over pockets were missable for me yesterday. <laughs> well. Yeah. Man, how good, mm. yeah. Yeah, Stevie. Oh. Uh, oh. Looks like someone's doing 100 push-ups. Yeah, what? Well, did he... Did... Uh, I don't think he agreed to it, but I'm still happy to do 100 push-ups. I do a few hundred a day anyway, so that doesn't really make a difference. I was going to say, you do 100 for fun, don't you? Yeah, I do... Just, a, yeah. As the kettle boils, I'll, do, I'll smash out 100. I'll oh, actually smash out 40 and then another 40. Yeah. <laughs> So Luke actually played a really loose. Obviously, the ner nerves would get you at this point. That's the only reason why going the way he did, obviously, if you landed too straight on the bottom, you'd have to punch it yep. back out. So, but no problem here for Luke. He just... Nah, well done, Luke. This is a good, good performance you've been playing well. I think this well. is his first big title. I don't know if he's won... He's probably won tournaments in WA, yeah. but as far as nationally... No, this um, is good. You know, this is going to no, be happy, awesome. Ha really happy for him. Good on you, Luke. Yeah. Uh, well done, Luke. Very deserving winner. Well done, WA. Well done, Luke Anglesey. And there's that smile. Alrighty, thanks guys. We'll be jumping off now, and um, if it's up, if you want to do the do the women's mix, you can. But I'll, yeah, I'll yeah, be I'll, uh, I might come back for that. Still, oh. still get a drink. Thanks, guys. All right, everyone. I will see you and speak to you soon. Cheers.